Hmm. Unlock. All right. Welcome back to another Doing It Russ. Today we are talking keys. What is the best key for your R1T? Let's do it. All right. So I don't know if you guys are like me and you saw that video. I can literally walk right up to my R1T using my phone as my key. Now I have a tendency to keep my phone in my back pocket all the time and I can on more than one occasion walk up to the car and actually have uh, the car stay locked and, um, and it's actually quite annoying. Um, I thought I would love my phone being my key but I actually find that it is really inconvenient that if I have my hands full, I walk up to the car, I'm gonna have to pull out my key, or excuse me, my phone, to unlock the car. All right, so here's an example. I actually, uh, the truck is unlocked, the key is in my back pocket. I'm back here at the tailgate. There's been many times where I've been working actually at the back of the truck and it will unrecognize me. Of course, it's not gonna do it now since I actually have uh, it on camera. And the car will lock as I'm literally just standing at the back of the truck. Um, it's actually been quite annoying. The other thing that uh, has happened twice now, and I don't know is a big concern yet, but I have been maybe five feet away from the truck and my wife and my stepdad have both gone and put their hand actually in here. And the car didn't recognize me being that close to the vehicle and locked while their hand was in here. Now luckily they pulled their hand out and I don't know what it would have really done if they didn't, but uh, it has pinched both of their fingers. So I'm not sure if that needs to be a update or uh, maybe something Rivian should look into in the future. Now, the second option is you could actually use the actual, like, business card. Now, although I think that this is a nice option to have on you at all times, um, there is instructions on how to use it on the back side, so you'd have to um, swipe it on the door so it locks. So you can swipe it to unlock, and then once you're in the car, you'll actually swipe it on the door to activate it. Now, I'm gonna keep that in my wallet at all times just in case I need to give that to somebody for whatever reason, although I'm the only one driving the truck. Uh, I think it is a good option to have. Not ideal to get in and out of your car every single day. At last, but certainly not least, is the actual key fob, and we'll get in the car here. Um, so, I think that the key fob actually is one of the best options. Not only is it <laughs> really cool and practical that I could put it on a belt if I needed to. Um, people love talking about it and be like, oh my God, it's um, it, it's a carabiner. It's, you know, it's another discussion point that people will have with the Rivian. Um, it'll allow me to function the vehicle as I normally would if it were any other car. I think for me, that's the most ideal. The other thing that it gives me a great deal of confidence with is when I walk away from the vehicle, I can just double click this real quick, even being three feet away, hear the little chirp and feel confident that the car is locked. I have used my phone and as you walk away, it's supposed to um, uh, predict kind of how far away you are and go, oh, the key is not within the vicinity of the car. I, I don't know the exact footage that you need to be away, but the car will automatically lock. I think it's on average, if I had to guess, maybe 20 feet. Um, and there are times where I've actually walked a great distance and looked back and the car was 
still unlocked. Um, and then of course, when I look, it would lock, but um, I, it just doesn't give me a great deal of confidence. So I think for me, the key of choice is the key fob. Curious what you guys think. Now, I have the adventure package, so I did not get the, the waterproof bracelet, but um, I would be interested to hear your thoughts if anybody has the bracelet, if they use it, what they think about it. Um, and if anybody has heard anything about any aftermarket possible keys, I know Tesla has a ring that's very effective. I'd be curious to see what's coming in the future. Now, um, of course, not everybody's going to agree with my thoughts on what the best key is and how it functions, but um, that's just my opinion. I appreciate you guys joining in and getting my thoughts on this. Uh, we'll see you guys in the future.